to-do list like this one? Then do this. Click here and select this range, then press Alt and CB to add checkboxes. Now go here and to enter the number of tasks, type number, then the sequence function, followed by the count function, so we can select the range where we're going to input the tasks. If we type something on the task list, it's going to automatically add the task number. Enter this count of formula to get the completed task percentage, and to get the remaining tasks, enter one minus the completed percentage. Here, make it equal to the completed percentage. Go to home, then conditional formatting, and add data bars. Make sure to show only the bar, set the type to number, and put zero and one. Pick the color and confirm. Now select this range. Go again to conditional formatting and add this rule. If the checkbox is equal to true, then the format will change, the fill color will turn green, and the font will have a strike through. And that's it. We now have our dynamic to-do list in Excel.